so today we are doing a big fan favourite. We are doing a H&M Plus clothing haul. Stay tuned. and welcome to my channel thank you so much for joining me today hello if you're new i'm becky and i do loads of plus size fashion content along with beauty and lifestyle as well so if you haven't yet don't forget to click that big red subscribe button down below i upload every tuesday and thursday uh, so lots of content to enjoy on this channel and hello to my lovely regulars thank you so much for joining me today um I love H&M along with you guys, um, so it's always nice to have a look and see what they've got in uh, stock. But first up, I'm feeling a little bit peckish. I'm feeling a little bit hungry. So this portion of the video is sponsored by HelloFresh. So I've been using HelloFresh for literally years, even before I started doing YouTube, and they are a huge time saver. Uh, this year, I'm trying to spend less time doing jobs I don't like doing, um, you know, like going to the supermarket every other day. I'm trying to like really use my time wisely. Um, and that's what's great about HelloFresh is it's really, really easy to order um, your weekly food on um, your phone or laptop and it gets delivered straight to your door. Um, all the meat is packed cold and fresh so you have no worries there. Um, and you can just start making your meals that evening. It's such a good service and the food is delicious. They have so many different meal types as well. Um, they've got um, calorie conscious meals, rapid meals, family meals, vegetarian meals, um, gastro pub meals, so many different uh, cuisines to try. So let me show you the meals I picked out this week. So these are the meals I've picked. This is the one I think we're going for today. It's the teriyaki sriracha salmon and ginger rice bowl. Um, it sounds so yummy. Um, then I've got this delicious mango and coconut chicken curry. This is a classic recipe. It only takes 20 to 25 minutes, which is great. Um, and then this is even quicker. It's a rapid meal, only takes 20 minutes. And this is um, something a bit different for me. It's a Middle Eastern style lamb stew. So I'm trying to kind of um, explore some different foods different cuisines and this is also free of my five a day which is impressive um but also as well as dinners they do a, a breakfast lunches and also sides you could have this as a starter or like a family snack or something honey drizzled bacon wrapped halloumi with sweet chili mayo oh my god it sounds so good so if you want to start the new year with hello fresh then you can get a massive 60 percent off your first box plus 25% off for the next two months and they're even going to throw in some free gifts as well so use my discount code on the screen here if you fancy taking advantage of that offer there's also a link in the description box down below and also for you tv watchers out there or on your google homes i have a qr code qr code on the screen now you can scan that with your phone and it will take you directly to the offer so it's so simple so easy that's on the screen now if you fancy taking advantage of this really great offer here are all our delicious fresh ingredients that were delivered to my front door this morning um, and everything looks so fresh and delicious I can't wait to get cooking with it so here is the big reveal it actually looks really good. No, I've not put the radishes on. That's one of the good things about HelloFresh. If you're not a fan of an ingredient, you can just omit it um, rather than having to like pull stuff out of something you've already bought. Um, so I've not put the radishes, but the radishes will be going home to my parents because they love radishes. So I'm going to give this a taste now. So I've got myself a mouthful of everything. Let's give it a go. Mm -hmm. Wow, 
that is so tasty the thing i love about hello fresh is you get all the garnish as well like when you're normally making a meal you don't really want to spend the extra on the things that really do finish a dish like fresh spring onions and toasted sesame seeds but that comes with all the meals there's always these little flourishes um that just really add to a dish and um, that is delicious and ginger basmati rice what a revelation uh, so if you're interested in trying hello fresh for the first time i'll leave my discount code on the screen as well as my fancy new qr code thanks so much to hello fresh for sponsoring this video it's always a pleasure to work with them now back to today's haul video massive thank you to hello fresh for sponsoring a portion of today's video um now i'm nice and full <laughs> let's get on with today's haul um so as always everything will be linked down below they are affiliate links that just means it doesn't cost you anything extra but if you do fancy picking anything up i will get a small bit of commission uh from the brand if you do buy through my links so really appreciate it uh, if you choose to do so they are just in the description box down below um yeah let's get straight into this haul shall we so this is a bit of a, an experiment um just trying some like different colors trying to go a little bit out of my comfort zone occasionally um so i do love like an oversized corduroy shirt um this one is from the um divided range um and this is in a 4xl when anything is divided it's in like youth sizing so it does tend to be um, size a lot smaller so I normally you'd go for a 4x in divided and normally a 3x in the regular H&M range but it really just varies on what I'm ordering um so this is really cute like I know the Barbie movie, movie is going to be coming out this year isn't it and it's giving me major like Barbie vibes <laughs> especially with the white tank top and the blue jeans um these are some it's um H&M mum jeans i'll try and find them but i believe they've changed their sizing on the mum jeans now so i don't know what ones these are but i'll have a look um but this is really cute it's really nicely oversized um where it you know it looks like it's meant to be oversized not too tight or anything um really really cute you've got a little pocket up here which is nice um we'll see the sleeves well, it's oversized, so you're going to have oversized sleeves as well. It's also a really nice length as well. It's not too long, so I don't feel like I'm drowning in it. Um, you've got these little cute pink matching buttons, and I imagine because it's from the divided range, it's quite affordable. I find, to be honest, like H&M, their stuff to just be generally really affordable, um, especially for plus size. Ah, I just love just love shopping from h&m guys so yeah you could obviously do this up if you want but i do think wearing the little white top or a black top underneath helps break up the pink i think a lot of pink is, is a lot of pink <laughs> so i do think this is really really cute especially as we head into spring let me know what you think down below in the comments so for this to be coming out in january i do think it's a bit crazy but the thing with h&m is it just sells if it's something cute it sells out straight away so if you like this and you want it for summer it's like spring or summer time i would suggest buying it because it won't be there in a few months time this is a really cute blue and white mini dress with a gorgeous sweetheart neckline um this was from the h&m range um but because of the style of dress I did get it in a 4XL just because it's a bit more of that kind of like A-line dress, which sometimes can be a bit tight around here. Um, and as you can see, I think I made the best decision. I think if I got it in a 3XL, it would be tighter, but like when you're sitting down and stuff, like it's just not going to be a vibe. Sorry if you can see the band of my underwear, uh, because this does not come with a slip, um, which... Uh, I'm a little bit on the fence about because if I'm honest like I would wear this with um, my snag nude chub rub shorts and probably some light underwear underneath anyway so I don't think I would need a slip um that's just my reality and I do get hot so having an extra layer um and also that's just gonna put the price up 
So I would obviously be a bit more conscious about like, what I'm wearing underneath it, but I don't mind that. It's such a lovely print. It is adjustable here as well, so you can make it as big or as small as you want. Um, it's definitely more kind of like off the shoulder vibes. Um, I do prefer it though when I don't need my bra straps to be like slid down, but it is what it is, but it's really, really cute, really, really pretty, um, and feels really nice quality. Like I feel like H&M stuff could always gives the illusion of something that costs a little bit more money, and that's what this dress is kind of giving me. Um, so yeah, I think it's really, really pretty, and if you like it and you want it for spring, summer, buy it now in January. <laughs> This is super cute. Now these are the kind of cardigans I love to wear as jumpers. Um, it's in this gorgeous lilac shade with big matching lilac buttons. It feels really, really nice. This is not scratchy at all. It's really soft um, knit, quite a chunky knit though. I just really, really like it. It's really, really nicely fitted. Um, it is gonna be a crop situation. Um, so if you are wearing it a bit like a top, like a jumper, just bear that in mind. This is how I would wear mine though, like in an outfit like this. Um, but obviously if you're throwing this over a cardigan or a long line t-shirt, you know, if you're, sorry, if you're throwing this over a dress, sorry, or a long line t-shirt, then obviously you don't need to worry about uh, your tummy section being on show. Uh, but I really don't mind mine being on show. Uh, it's there, it exists, as I say in other videos, you know, I don't want to hide it all the time. <laughs> uh, so I really, really like this. It's really great quality. They were definitely promoting this range. It, I think it was like some sort of like excellent value range where it was just really good basics for really good prices. Um, and they also did this in some other colours as well. I just thought with spring coming, I thought I'd show you the kind of like funnest uh, trend colour but I think they did it in like black and you know all those kind of colours so if you're not a fan of the lilac they did do it in other colours too but H&M their prices are so good and their quality is also good it's such a win-win um so yeah I love this cardigan it's it's really nice so I haven't tried a pair of trousers from H&M in the longest time um, because I love my H&M mom jeans so much, but I have been, I think I, I can't remember the last time I tested a pair of like flared legging trousers, but they've always intrigued me, um, but they are just a bugger to find like the perfect pair for me. Um, so these are obviously from H&M. Um, they are the teensiest, teensiest bit, too long. Um, so I have to pull them up quite high and also this isn't like <laughs> the best feedback they kind of smell <laughs> like the only way I can describe the smell is like fishy <laughs> it's not fishy but it's like bitter I can't think of any other words to describe the smell of them so I don't know if that would go away with washing them, but there is a smell, because it is that kind of like stretchy synthetic material, um, but they are thick and they are really comfortable. I got them in 3XL because I didn't want them to be like too big and loose on me, like so big and stretchy that they would fall down. So I do think 3XL is the right size for me. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know really what I'd wear with them either, but I do quite like this little outfit I put together. Um, so on top is a jumper from Divided. Um, I really, really liked these big, bold flower prints with these big pink middles. So I feel like it's quite like a little cohesive look. I have just got this little tank top underneath them as I'm trying stuff on. Um, but I don't... I think the tank top's quite nice because it just kind of breaks everything up a little bit um, and also gives you an idea of how long <laughs> the top is. So uh, the jumper is, again, it is a cropped style. It just seems to be <laughs> the case with a lot of jumpers. It's either long or it's cropped. There's no middle ground. <laughs> um, but I really like how kind of like big and loose this one is. This isn't the thickest jumper 
which I don't mind because sometimes I get too hot in jumpers if they're too thick. I like being able to layer, so you could put like your thermal black top under, you know, your long sleeve top underneath if it's that cold, but if it, you know, in the spring starts to get a little bit warmer, you're still, you know, comfy. Um, it's a really nice knit as well. Again, this was divided, so it is probably got an even more affordable price tag. It's just really, really cute and fun. And I love the big prints. We'll just, uh, just no notable notice. <laughs> There is none on the back, so um, I'm guessing that's where they are cutting costs. But for me, that's not a big deal breaker because I'm only looking at myself from the front anyway. So <laughs> that's what's important. So I think the jumper is really, really cute. But I'm on the fence about the legging, um, flare leggings and the, the fabric. No, I'd rather have like more traditional like leggingy jersey feel than this kind of like thick scuba feel and the smell isn't great. <laughs> so guys, I feel like I should be in like the craft or craft. I don't know how you say the film name, but you know like the 90s like witch, or I could be in Sabrina the Teenage Witch or Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Like I feel like it's very like 90s grunge, witchy vibes and I love it. This is from the Divided range, so I did get a 4XL. Um, I was a little bit worried it was going to be a bit uh, bit big. Um, I think I could have got a 3XL and it had actually been a little bit more form-fitting, which for this dress would probably have been uh, a bit cuter, but the 4X does still fit really nicely, so it's really just preference on whether you like things to fit more tightly or looser, and there's nothing wrong with that. Um, so it is this like mesh, uh, stretchy mesh floral, and then you've got a little black slit underneath. I love the neckline. It's this really pretty sweetheart neckline. It's so cute. And then you've just got just the mesh on the arms with like a little lettuce hem. <laughs> it's so, so cute. I feel like I would love this more though, I feel like in autumn. Like, cause it's just giving me like spooky vibes. I really like it. I think it's really pretty if you don't want to be too girly or, you know, with like pastels and stuff. Like it's still like really cute and feminine, but a bit more like edgy. I love that look. Um, so yeah, I think again, it's divided. So it's gonna be really, really good price. Um, so yeah, I think I probably would have got a free XL if I, was in the shop and could try it all on. <laughs> but alas, we're not quite there yet with plus size fashion. Um, but this one's really cute. And you do have the lettuce hem as well on the bottom of the dress um, and some little ruching here. It's just really cute, guys. If this is your vibe, this is chef's kiss. So I am a part of the H&M plus size sweatshirt appreciation group. Um, there are a few of us here on YouTube that love H&M sweatshirts. Um, I do try other brands because I love sweatshirts. Don't ask me why, I just want to live in them. Um, and my go-to kind of like working from home situation is like a hoodie or a sweatshirt and leggings. That's what I love to wear. So um, yeah, I always pick up some sweatshirt and I don't even normally keep the sweatshirt. <laughs> Uh, that I pick up uh, but yeah there are other others of you in the comments that I know also love H&M sweatshirts because they're sized properly um, especially when you want that like oversized baggy look like they really do you know give you the option to do that so this is a 4XL so it is uh, bigger and baggier on me and I feel like if you're a 4XL it is going to fit you a bit more sweatshirty like but i still think you're gonna have like room and i still think it's gonna look more like loose on you than a lot of the sweatshirts oh sorry oh my hair seems like it's sick a lot of the sweatshirts from other brands make like i've tried from boohoo to like river island to mango i've tried so many sweatshirts and no one makes plus size sweatshirts like h&m does 
um, and some people in the comments will also agree with me. Um, so this one is just a plain minty green colour. Love the colour for spring. Um, just a really nice basic. Um, I'd probably pair this with jeans or leggings. Um, probably not with these little flared trousers. Um, but it's a little comfy look. Um, these are great just for literally airports. I love wearing sweatshirts uh, when I'm flying places. Just because they're like very durable and like I always get to wreck on when I fly from Gatwick and I always get ramming down my top and they wash really well and they don't leave any stains they're comfortable they're really great to layer so you don't get too hot too cold um yeah and I said they wash really really nicely so um this one's a really cute color I hope they come out with more cute colors for spring um I really want a lilac sweatshirt um, so if you're listening, <laughs> like in the colour of that cardigan, that would be really cute. Maybe with some cute prints. I think I need to like put on some sort of like sweatshirt notification when H&M come out with more. But yeah, this one's really cute. <laughs> So guys, that is the end of today's video. Let me know what you thought of everything down below in the comments. I love to hear all of your opinions. And if you haven't yet and you've gotten this far, then why not subscribe and hit that bell so you can be notified every time I upload every Tuesday and Thursday. Um, and of course, give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Huge thanks again to HelloFresh for sponsoring a portion of this video. I will leave the QR code somewhere on the screen so if you are watching um on your tv um it's a great opportunity to take advantage of the offer um at the of, while you're sitting lounging on your sofa <laughs> so i will catch you in the next one bye